thank you for coming in another video oh my gosh honestly y'all i have a quick question for those of you who have natural hair specifically my afro puff girls i have a question for y'all so as you can see i'm driving and i'm in a car and what I've noticed is I can take as much time as I want to pick out my fro, make sure my curls are popping, and you know, make sure my fro looks really big. But then I get into the car and I notice that my afro doesn't have the amount of volume that it normally does. Then, when I get to my destination and get out of the car, my fro looks like it was literally put in a box. Now, I want to know to my sisters who rock the fro by choice, or in general, just rock the fro and drive. Is this a me thing? Am I overthinking this? Or does this actually happen where it's like your fro doesn't look the same when you get out of the car because of the roof of the car i don't know if i'm explaining that correctly but that's just something that i genuinely wonder about like why does the roof of the car gotta disrespect my fro i took about five to ten minutes to you know get my situation situated and my fro is just not looking too good like by the time i'm telling you i'm going to the grocery store right now by the time i get out of this car my fro is gonna look like i took it out of a box let me know down below because this is ridiculous i'm starting to get frustrated and if there are any tips to maintain my fro while commuting in a car please let me know because i'm getting real sick and tired of having a box fro that's what I'm gonna call it, a box fro. The side effect of driving with an afro, box fro. Anyway, that was it y'all, I'm over here rambling. I hope y'all have a great day.